Mickey's Not-So-Scary Halloween Party. This separately ticketed event runs from 7 p.m. to midnight on select nights this fall at Magic Kingdom Park. Experience unique characters, exclusive entertainment, attraction overlays, trick-or-treat stops, photo opportunities, and specialty food and drink. Here are top tips for attending this frog favorite event. Oh, and don't forget that you can enjoy some spooky savings by purchasing your Mickey's Not-So-Scary Halloween Party tickets through Undercover Tourist. 1. Arrive Early While the party officially runs from 7 p.m. to midnight, you can enter Magic Kingdom as early as 4 p.m. with a party ticket. At the park entrance, head to the event turnstiles to tap in and receive your party wristband. Once inside the park, you'll be directed to the right into a hallway just for party guests. Here, you'll receive a 50th anniversary reusable Halloween treat bag and your first candy. Already in the park, you can receive your party wristband at Tortuga Tavern in Adventureland and across from Monsters Inc. Laugh Floor in Tomorrowland. Be sure to get your wristband as regular day guests without a wristband will be directed to leave once the park closes at 6 p.m. Between 4 and 7 p.m., we recommend using this time to take photos, ride attractions, and eat dinner before the party gets started. 2. Dress up What's Halloween without some awesome costumes? Frogs of all ages, even adults, can dress up during Mickey's Not-So-Scary Halloween Party. Be mindful of the Florida temperatures and be prepared with lightweight costumes or a themed t-shirt, especially for the August and September parties. Be sure to double-check Disney's costume guidelines for this special event. Get creative! Will your crew be dressed as royalty, superheroes, or even our favorite, Familia Madrigal from Encanto? 3. Visit Characters Speaking of dressing up, your favorite Disney characters are also decked out for Halloween. Meet characters like Mickey and friends in exclusive outfits, or even rarely seen characters such as Stitch dressed up as Elvis or Jack Skellington and Sally. Some of the popular lines can have a long wait, so be sure to prioritize which characters you'd like to meet. 4. Savor specialty food and drink There are tons of seasonal goodies available for purchase during regular park hours, but there are some items exclusive to Mickey's Not-So-Scary Halloween Party. These include froggy favorites such as Pain and Panic Hot Dog from Casey's Corner, Not-So-Poison Apple Pie Milkshake from Anti-Gravity's Galactic Goodies, and Sweet Almond Corn Cake from Pecos Bill. 5. Enjoy Entertainment You won't want to miss the frog-tastic entertainment during the party, like the Hocus Pocus Villain Spectacular Show featuring our favorite Sanderson sisters and other Disney villains. This popular show makes its return after three years. Be sure to catch one of the many showtimes throughout the night. Stay for the midnight show to maximize your night. Disney's not-so-spooky spectacular fireworks return, hosted by Jack Skellington himself. For those close enough, catch him on stage for portions of the show. This show combines fireworks, music, and projections into a booming production. Follow Mickey and friends as they go from trick-or-treating to a whirlwind adventure featuring dancing skeletons, ghosts, and your favorite Disney villains. But the star of the night may have to be the Boo to You Parade. Before the parade starts, the Headless Horseman trots down the parade route, and you won't believe your eyes. While waiting for the parade, those on portions of Main Street USA and Town Square can stand out with a special appearance from Max Goof as Powerline. Join Max and crew with an energetic dance party in the streets, then settle back to enjoy the parade, featuring characters like Mickey and friends in their Halloween costumes, Captain Jack Sparrow, Constance Hatchaway and the Gravediggers, Pixar characters, the popular hitchhiking ghosts, and of course, the many Disney villains. We recommend trying to see the later showings of the parade for a less crowded view. Boo to you! 6. Dance the Night Away It wouldn't be a Disney Halloween party without a dance party. Mike and Sully play host to their own monstrous Screamoween Ball on the Rocket Tower Plaza stage in Tomorrowland. Do it like the zombies do at the new Zombies Bash in Cosmic Ray's Starlight Cafe or dance the night away at the Disney Junior Jam at Storybook Circus. 7. 
trick or treat towards the end of the night. While trick or treating is available for the duration of the party, you'll find the shortest wait in the last hour of the event. The first trick or treat stop at the entrance is only available until 8 p.m., while all the others are open for the entire party. There are 13 treat stations throughout the park, along with two allergy friendly stations. Guests can pick up an allergy-friendly blue treat bag near City Hall or Liberty Square and collect blue tokens at regular treat stops to redeem for allergy-friendly goodies. No tricks here! Have you attended Mickey's Not-So-Scary Halloween Party? What tips do you have? Be sure to share with us in the comments. Happy Halloween! Get the exact same theme park tickets for less, no catch, at Undercover Tourist.